Okay, so in this video I want to go over briefly how to add integers uh, using counters. Okay, And this is one way to visualize what's going on when we're adding integers, positive and neg negative numbers. And so we represent the positive numbers with this yellow side up counters. These are called counters. Okay, So we have four positive counters and then we have one, two, three, oops, four, five, six, seven negatives, okay? And so what we're going to do now is we're going to see that uh, we all, we know, I think, that a positive and a negative, so if you thought of like positive one and negative one, those are going to end up canceling each other out. Another way you could kind of think of it as one minus one, but let's not get ahead of ourselves. We're adding integers right now, so this positive and this negative is going to cancel each other out, and so we're going to remove those and put those to the side. And then, likewise, these two are going to cancel each other, and these two are going to cancel each other, and these two are going to cancel each other. And what we're left when all of these positives and negatives cancel each other out is a negative 3. And so 4 plus negative 7 is going to be negative 3. Okay, let's do a few more. Uh, the next problem I want to do is adding two negatives. So we'll do negative 3 plus negative 2. So we'll represent the negative 3 with 1, 2, 3 reds. We'll represent this negative 2 with 1, 2 reds. And if we add those together, we can see that we get one, two, three, four, five red, and red is negative, so negative three plus negative two equals negative five. Okay, let's do another one. How about if we have negative five plus eight? Okay, so I have my negative five represented here. Two, four, six, eight, and then we're going to match up these positive and negatives and, re and cancel them out. So here's one set that cancels, two, three, four, and five, and we're left with three yellows, and we know that yellow is positive, so that's positive three, okay? Let's do one last one. If I have negative 6 okay, negative 6 plus 2. Okay. Here we have my let me put that on the screen. Negative 6. There's a positive 2. And then if we if these two cancel out, cancel each other out, we're left with negative four. Okay? Using counters is one way we can model adding integers. And so I hope you found this helpful. Thank you for watching.